Well, it's good, guys. Good morning. Ugh. A little rough. Anyway, day after or morning after Hurricane Delta. Um, nothing bad here in New Orleans. It just I wanted to do this battery backup as a means to, I guess, self sufficiency. Um, just an experiment, really. Um, to see what I could do with it. Now, here's the real test. <clears throat> now, the battery, plenty of power. That's not the issue. The issue is this little joker here. But really, not this. It's actually this joker here. I need coffee this morning. And this was going to be like the final test. So, now let's go ahead Turn it on. Lights up. This thing kicks on. No coffee. Lots of beeps. This is the test right here. It hadn't gotten this far before. I've tried twice before this one. <coughs> Hot damn. This was going to be the test. was to brew a pot of coffee. Because a pot of coffee is like 600 watts. So. And I smell it. It's brewing. Thank God I don't smell this thing yet. Can't tell what the hell that's saying either. 830 watts. For coffee. <laughs> what the hell? This should only be about 600 watts. So I guess I gotta go rethinking all of this. Um, I definitely need a different power inverter. Uh, let's see. It ran everything ran the little fan that I bought plugs in on USB runs this uh, Coleman ice chest so keep all the insulin and whatnot cold does all that great so now with this this is going to be placed outside because of the fumes um, there are no fumes inside right now but I've had this area highly ventilated the last several days but what I want to do is I want to put these on there and what I'm going to do is run a stainless steel bolt through here and mount them about like this one here and one on this side and that'll be my positive and negative see if I can't yeah I can get it but all that'll do this is just a cap large cap that covers up over that I was going to do this on the boat um you know just don't let a just don't let a kid step on it not like uh I've seen that once or twice set that down but now I'm just going to stick a bolt in there then you just get your alligator clips and you connect your alligator clips to this on the side plug your battery charger onto it or your maintainer and walk away from it and you're good so anyway that's how I was going to charge the boat before but um, anyway I'll do this for the battery backup except I'm going to add a third battery so I'm just slide these two over and put a third battery in there uh, not much boil over this morning everything's still dry so I, uh, two batteries took about three quarters of a gallon of distilled water before I, before I put the trickle charge on them. I am actually stunned right now, dude. We're getting coffee. That's like, that's the ultimate. Now, it failed twice before this test. So, everything else passes. It was just, that's the biggest test. Did I have enough of an inverter 
to brew coffee in a no power situation seems that I do where's it at now 823 I wonder what these uh... anyway no so you um, start digging for different inverters and um, find which one I really want uh, another battery then let's see probably a solar panel or two probably two solar panels and charge controller so that way then this would be a a, a whole setup as far as solar panel power so like let's say that this battery bank uh, works and does great um, but the power is out here for I don't know three months you know then what what, what how are you gonna recharge the batteries and you know, get your stick and wave it in the air and go up and down outside hey uh, yeah hey, uh, hey. no that ain't gonna work that's a rain dance that ain't <laughs> oh, dog I need my coffee <laughs> well, no Sit that up out in the driveway, out in the yard, either way, doesn't matter. Recharge these batteries, keep them charged. Don't just buy expensive batteries like this and throw them in the back of a closet. You got to maintain them, keep checking the levels, all of that. But anyway, y'all, this was the biggest test, and it looks like we passed, but how much? We got us about a half a pot, so I can... I can get a full cup out of that and be all right. Let the rest of it finish brewing. Brewing a lot slower. Normally it would have been finished by now, but I guess that's modified sine wave. So anyway, y'all, just an update. Everything else was a success. Uh, the coffee this morning I figured was not going to be, but so I was going to record an epic fail. But evidently. Looks like we didn't muff the punt after all. So, anyway, y'all be cool. Later.